You see the car? The water entered the car and the water was like this on me, like on my chest. Soaked, exhausted, but lucky to be alive. Alufa made Johnson showing news for her inside of her muddy truck after fast rising floodwaters almost swept her away. She says at one point she thought she wouldn't make it. The Good Samaritans rushing to the rescue. I was screaming, I can't swim, I'm shot, I'm gonna drown, please come and help me. Nobody could hear me because the glass was down, I was honking the on before they could hear that I'm in the van. Monday afternoon, flash floods sweeping parts of Prince George's County. This parking lot off Kenilworth Ave near Sarvis in Riverdale looking more like a lake. <laughs> Rounds of heavy rain causing the nearby river to rise, flooding the lot and leaving the folks who work here with little time to think. And then I started carrying my car like literally down like the trail right there. Kimberly Moreno says the flood carried her car more than 100 feet. She tried to move it, but the water just too much for her Nissan. When I first got out there, the water was like right like below like where you take that first step into the car. And then within a minute of me getting in the car, the water had risen to like halfway up the door. And yeah, I turned my car, tried to move it. And like within a few seconds, it like flooded, just seized up. And then it carried me away. Moreno getting out before it was too late. But you can see from these pics, the water coming up to the headrest. It like went all the way up to here. So the water got really hot, high up. Now the hard part of cleanup and repairs. I'm relieved, but also stressed. And I got to deal with all the car stuff. And yeah, just still kind of in shock. And I want to cry. And it's just a lot, like overwhelmed. But these drivers say, despite the headaches, they're thankful it wasn't worse. I feel happy I'm safe. But right now my head is spinning because I can't, I'm still trying to process war happened because it has never happened like this before. And at one point, Prince George's County fired deploying rescue boats to the area, but thankfully, no reports of serious injuries. In Riverdale, Walter Morris, News 4.